it could be a nuclear game changer. Today, North Korea said it successfully set off a thermonuclear weapon, a hydrogen bomb. The underground blast triggered a magnitude 6.3 earthquake near North Korea's nuclear testing site deep in the mountains. The physics of hydrogen bombs, or H-bombs, make them far more destructive than the atomic weapons North Korea is believed to have tested in the past. Today's test, though not verified, sent shockwaves around the world. Ben Tracy begins our coverage. State television said North Korea carried out what it called a perfect test of a hydrogen bomb. In a statement, it said the test allowed North Korea to confirm the power control technology and internal structural design newly introduced into manufacturing H-bomb to be placed at the payload of the ICBM. North Korea claims it can now manufacture a nuclear-tipped missile capable of reaching the United States. On Sunday, the regime released these pictures of Kim Jong-un inspecting what North Korea says is a miniaturized hydrogen bomb to be placed on an intercontinental ballistic missile. The nuclear test comes just days after the North fired a missile directly over Japan. The U.S. and South Korea responded by conducting high-profile bombing drills on the Korean peninsula. Tensions have rapidly escalated since just two weeks ago when President Trump suggested his tough talk on North Korea was working. Kim Jong-un, I respect the fact that I believe he is starting to respect us. North Korea has been warning about a sixth nuclear test since April, and Kim Jong-un has significantly accelerated the pace of North Korea's weapons development, despite international sanctions designed to cripple his regime. Kim Jong-un has now launched more missiles just this year than his father did during his entire 17 years in power. And the bomb they just tested is believed to be far more powerful than the ones dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki here in Japan at the end of World War II. Elaine. Ben Tracy, thanks.